To Tommy beloved mom, Chris, Wilson, Wyman, Wayne and families, we are all here tonight to pay tribute to a great individual who forever will be in our memory. We wanted to let you all know that because of your son, your husband, your dad, and father-in-law Mr. Tommy. We all laughed a little harder, smiled a lot more and, definitely have had more fun together in the past. I am Kieran O'Brien. And with me my wife Stephanie. Tommy my friend will be greatly missed by many. My memories of Tommy will never be extinguished. His welcoming of me and my family to Malaysia and the many good times we had with him will always stay with us. To Tommy's family, our prayers are with you and please cherish to Tommy's beloved mum, Chris, Wilson, Wayne, Wyman and families. Our deepest condolences to all of you for the loss of dear Tommy. He was such a force of nature smart, kind and generous. It was a combination that drew people to him along with his infectious laugh and that twinkle in his eye. He opened his heart and his home, as well as love of delicious food and a good party, to us in a way like no other. Tommy was more than our favorite fan B manager, he was our Malaysian family. May he rest in peace. Melanie and John Dearest Chris, Wilson, Wayne, Wyman, Tommy's three beautiful daughter-in-laws and his beloved grandchildren, extended family and friends, I send you my deepest condolences. Please forgive me if my voice is a bit shaky as I share this message. I just lost a true friend, mentor, and supporter. Someone who was like a father and a best friend, all in one. I know I must be sharing this message with a very full room, as Tommy was incredibly loved and respected in his family, in his community, and at our workplace. I can imagine today and in the days to come, many people are sharing memories and photos with a smile thinking of those special times with Tommy. For me, even though I've only known him the last five years, there are too many good memories to count. I first met Tommy in January 2017 when I moved to Malaysia for an assignment leading a team he was a part of. Tommy had over 30 years experience in operations at that time, and I was going to lead the group that he worked in with almost zero direct experience in that area. I can only imagine it was quite a shock to him. Tommy met me in the lobby my very first day at Monero and ExxonMobil, and no one asked him to do that or assigned him to do that, but that was just the type of guy Tommy was. He had recognized me, told me his name, and took me with him, and he never left my side since that day. Simple things at first, like picking me up in the first few days to take me to my medical when he knew I would be lost, to showing up with breakfast, introducing new things, and just generally taking care of me both at work and personally. Even in the recent months as I've changed jobs, he dropped me a message and shares concern and offer advice. Over time, he grew to be one of my most trusted colleagues and importantly, a friend to me and my family. I will forever treasure the memories I've made with him, Chris, our extended circle of friends. He called me as Cedapur and I would joke that he was my food and beverage manager because of all of his commitment to recognizing others, sharing good times, including weddings, retirements, service anniversaries, Chinese New Year, and generally just gathering with friends. I know today is a sad day for so many of us and I wish I could be there in person to support his family. I share in your grief and mourn the loss of a great man with a huge heart and the lessons he had yet to teach us. In looking to the future, I'll say that while Tommy's earthly body may have left us, he lives on in so many of us, and I know he's watching out for us. I know personally he supported and coached me to achieve more than I thought was possible, and I'll continue to work to make him proud. Rest in peace, my dear friend. With much love and sympathy, Katrina. <laughs> 